Hey everyone, welcome back to the Cocktail Vlog. I'm Steve the Bartender and today I'm very excited because I'm doing something a little bit different and I'm just gonna show you through the distillery. Uh, I was hoping to do a little bit more uh, behind the scenes here during the build phase, but um, unfortunately I've been a little bit busy. So uh, for those of you who don't know, I've recently signed a book deal uh, with a US publisher. So that book will be coming out in uh, October, 2022 and I have been working on it quite a bit lately, hence why I haven't done many of these behind the scenes vlogs that I have wanted to do uh, throughout the build. Um, yeah, so I'll give you a little bit of a tour of the space. Now, keep in mind this front, like it's two different areas. The front space we have not worked on at all, but it will give you an idea of what this whole entire space looked like beforehand. Um, there's shit everywhere and yeah, there's, there's a whole bunch of junk and work gear. But as you can see around here, you've got this hideous, ugly blue carpet. Uh, the ceiling's not very nice, it's not pretty at all, but uh, it's, a, it's a big space. So moving from where we were before, which was quite small, this is uh, 450 square meters. Uh, I'll translate that to feet and put that on the screen. So for all of you guys in the US. Um, cool, all right. So this is the, the area that we will be installing the main bar over this side over here. I don't have a flip up screen at the moment, so hopefully I'm pointing in the right direction. Back over here, we're gonna have all booths. And over this side here, uh, is gonna be an eight meter long bar and there's gonna be a, a pizza oven and, and everything like that. So uh, pretty excited about that, but that's not gonna be until June. Uh, so mid next year, sorry, mid this year, uh, that that's all happening. Um, trades are back shortly and they'll get cracking on, on that. So at the moment, this is the part that we've been concentrating on. As you can see, it looks quite different. We've ripped off the off the ceiling. Um, this is more of an industrial space because where we produce the spirit, um, hence why we've kept that kind of look. And then we've uh, finished up the floor, uh, a couple of coats on the floor, and then we've got toilets over this side here. Uh, we've basically redone all the plumbing, all the electrical, not ourselves, obviously. Uh, had some professionals come in, um, but they've redone everything. So yeah, it's, uh, it's looking good. So just over here, Hope, I really hope you guys can see where I'm pointing. Just down here is where the tasting room bar is gonna be. And if I do a bit of a 180, this area here, we're gonna have a capacity of about 50 people, 50, 60 people. Um, nice big high tables that everyone can sit down at. Uh, that'll seat probably about 40. Uh, but yeah, this will be the tasting room. So you can oversee the, the production side of things. And you may have noticed I've got the still running in the background as well. I'm doing a little trial batch, not a little trial batch, um, I'm doing a trial batch uh, of like a, a classic dry style gin, which we haven't done as yet. And then after that, I'll be doing a couple of runs of our aromatic gin, which is kind of like a flagship, more of a citrus forward gin. Um, we have been absolutely pumped for that over Christmas and everything. So we really need to start doing a lot of distillation runs to, uh, to keep up with the, the demand, which is fantastic but uh, I'll take you over to the still. So our still is only a little baby in comparison to a lot of commercial distilleries. So there's only a 200 and we're soon placing an order for a new still, which will also be Australian made. And the still is gonna be probably around the 600 litre capacity mark. So triple the size of this one, uh, which will make us more efficient and we'll be able to make a lot more gin and hopefully be able to get some over to the US in, in the future. Uh, that's might take a, bit, a little while, but hopefully we'll get there. So yeah, this, this space is uh, obviously a work in progress, but we're getting there. Once the trades are back, they'll, uh, they'll install our new bar in the tasting room bar. That'll be a nice three meter bar. It's gonna look really schmick at the moment. It just looks a bit like a work site. We've only just moved in like literally last week. So uh, over here as well, this is where a cool room's gonna be. Uh, we've also got beer lines. So they'll be going in, we'll do cocktails on tap and we'll uh, do beer as well. So it's not just gonna be gin which is really cool. So all the people in the neighborhood can come and not be forced to drink gin if you don't like it. And if you do like it, then happy days. So I'm gonna keep this one short and sweet, but I just wanted to give you a quick tour. Hopefully now uh, in the new year, I'll be able to run you through some more stuff uh, in regards to drinks and distillation and the threefold side of things. I will link up here as well as in the description below to our new threefold channel, which at the moment, we don't have any content on there, but uh, we'll, we'll start doing some content. And I may, depending on the reaction from this video, if you guys enjoy it, let me know in the comments. Uh, I might 
start a second channel specifically for this kind of content. Let me know what you guys think. Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you soon for another cocktail vlog. Cheers.